How many likes does my latest tweet have? You have zero likes. You are lonely. Quick, before today's video starts, make sure to follow EY Stream on Twitter and Instagram. Check it out! We have a Mosasaurus in our Mosasaurus farm. Look at how absolutely massive this guy is inside our Mosasaurus farm. That is humongous! <laughs> Hey, what's up guys? EY Stream back here with another Minecraft video and today guys, I am going to be showing you how you can make an actually working Mosasaurus farm in Minecraft. If you guys are excited, make sure to go down below right now and you will see there's something called a like button and something called a dislike button and hear mind blowing stuff right now guys. Can you hit that like button and make it go below. We're gonna try and reach 2,000 likes today, guys. I have a little bit of a challenge. You can you basically become a massive dinosaur and stomp the like button? Can you hit the like button with your foot while stomping on that like button, guys? If you are able to do it, make sure to let me know in the comments below because I'll be pretty impressed if you can hit the like button by stomping on your tablet or phone or whatever, guys. That'd be pretty impressive. So let me know in the comments below. And if you guys are new to the channel, Oh, welcome! <laughs> Make sure to slap the subscribe button and hit the little bell icon to link ding ding next to the subscribe button to never miss an upload, guys. Make sure to do that. Make sure to go. Have you done it? Have you done it? Question mark. Have you done it? All right, cool. You've done it. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get started with today's video. Now, basically, guys, for those of you who don't know what a mosasaurus is, I need a little bit, of, need a little bit of background. I'm gonna give you just like a little bit of a background story right now. Basically, a mosasaurus. If you guys have seen Jurassic Park is this ginormous dinosaur that lives in the ocean. And basically, it's like six times the size of a T-Rex. In fact, it can eat a T-Rex. So if you're coming along, this is, imagine this is a T-Rex, guys. T-Rex is going, doo -doo 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 -doo. nice little day. The Mosasaurus will just be like, no! And just like consume the entire T-Rex just in one bite. This guy is absolutely massive. It might be one of the most dangerous dinosaurs of all time, which is exactly why we're going to make a farm for him, guys. We are going to try and build a Mosasaurus farm where not only it's safe and it won't go around eating your entire Minecraft world, but also we'll be able to view it and even breed it, perhaps. That'd be pretty awesome. Now, guys, to build the Mosasaurus farm, let's go ahead and we'll go through our material list. You are going to need... Dun, 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 dun. You're going to need some obsidian. That is block number one. You're going to need some glass, because every obviously we want to be able to view our Mosasaurus. You're also going to need water buckets, just like that. And finally, guys, you're going to need some iron bars. We are going to need a few more things later, but for now, that is all we are going to need. Now, the next step, guys, is to go ahead and do slash game rule, just like this. Show coordinates and then true, just like that, guys. And as you can see in my top left-hand corner, you can now see my coordinates. So it can go, oh, okay, I'm 8, 5, 3, 70, 110. Now, this is going to be super useful. Now, what we're going to do is build out the frame of our Mosasaurus farm first. So what we're going to do is I reckon we'll start in this we'll start here we'll start in this corner here guys and we'll just build all the way right across here this is going to take a little bit of time but let's go ahead and get started so here we go ba -ba -da -ba. all right we'll build this how rec how big do you reckon this has to be guys i reckon i'm not 100 percent sure how big this thing is in minecraft i think just for safety we're going to make it a little bit bigger and we'll cut right across here now, guys, the Mosasaurus. Oh, I can't wait to show you how absolutely ginormous this is. It is a mighty Mosasaurus. Oh, my gosh. Mighty Mosasaurus. Mighty Mosasaurus. Wait. Could this be a tongue twister? My Mighty Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mosasaurus. Oh, my gosh, guys. That is really, really hard to say. My Mighty Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mega Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mega Massive Mosasaurus. My Mighty Mega Massive Mosasaurus. Guys, try saying My Mighty Mega Mos Mosasaurus. Oh my gosh, I can't even say it now. Try saying My Mighty Mega Mosasaurus 20 times over as fast as you can. If you can do that, I'll be really, really impressed. So make sure to leave a comment below saying if you guys were able to do that. Because that is a tongue twister and a half. So here we go, guys. We built out the base of our Mosasaurus farm. Now what you want to do is build the sides, which is going to be the frame for our glass. So you want to go ahead. You kind of want to... I reckon about that high is probably probably high enough. So what's the how high is that, guys? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's about twelve blocks high there, guys, for your sides. So we go ahead. We'll build this side up. 
da, 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 and I'm just going to kind of guess that they're the same height. I hope they are. All right, Coolio. And basically, we're going to put glass in between these obsidian barriers, and that's going to basically reinforce our frame so that our Mosasaurus does not break out and shatter the glass, because that would be very, very bad, and we don't want that at all. So I reckon that's just about right. Now, guys, if you aren't using commands, if you are on console edition and you don't have access to commands, basically, you're going to need to fill in this entire area with glass. Now, that's going to take a long time. But if you guys are using PC Minecraft or Pocket Edition or Windows 10, you can go ahead and use commands just to fill this entire space with glass. And that's why we have the show coordinates. So all you guys want to do is have a look at your coordinates by standing in one of these corners. So here you guys can see I'm standing right in the corner and you want to have a look at your coordinates. Then you want to go ahead and write those coordinates down on like a phone or a piece of paper. So I've actually got my phone over here. I'm just going to write these down real quick. So 851 Now guys, remember your coordinates will be different depending on your Minecraft world. And what you want to do is then you want to go all the way to this side, right? And then you want to go ahead and fly all the way up here. And you want to place one block right here. And you want to go ahead and stand on that. And then you want to go ahead and copy your coordinates for that area as well. So here we go, guys. We've got 8517582, just like that. Then, here we go, guys. We're going to use what I what might be one of my favorite commands, slash fill. You want to go ahead and put in the set, first set of coordinates we got, which was 8516511. And then you want to go space and put in your second lot of coordinates, which in this case was 8517582 space and then you want to go ahead and put in the block you want to use so in this case we're going to go ahead we want to fill the entire area with glass hit enter and kablamo guys check it out we filled the entire area with glass just with one command and honestly i think that's probably the fastest and easiest way to do it now we're going to go ahead and just redo that on each of the four sides here guys so let's go ahead jump in this corner we'll copy down the command so bang 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 we got eight Fab, zero, six, fab, one, one, two, all right, cool. Then we're going to go ahead and jump all the way over to this side, up the top here, put one block down, then go ahead and jump down, all right. And then our, com our <laughs> coordinates are eight, two, zero, seven, five, one, one, two, just like that, guys. Ready? Ready for the awesome command slash fill eight, up, 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 coordinates in eight, five, zero, six, five, space one one two space and then you want to go ahead and put in your second lot of coordinates so in this case eight two zero i believe it was seven five and then one one two go ahead and glass bag check it out guys we filled this entire side with glass so that is two sides of our mosasaurus farm done i'm gonna go ahead and do the other two sides and you know do all the command magic and i'll cut to once it is over Alright guys, so as you can see, I have worked the beautiful command of magic and I filled in the other two sides with glass. So we've got the main part of our Mosasaurus farm done. Now the next thing we're going to do is just add a little bit more reinforcement to the farm so the Mosasaurus doesn't break the glass. So on these corners here guys, you just want to destroy these two side blocks and replace them with obsidian. And you want to go ahead and do this on every single side. So here we go guys, we'll do that. Jump over this side, and we'll go bam, 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 and we'll jump over here, blam, blam, oh, there we go, and that'll just add a little bit more reinforcement, just in case this Mosasaurus is a little feisty when we get him into our farm. Now, once you guys have done this, the next step you want to do is go ahead, and the Mosasaurus feeds off mycelium, so you want to go ahead and grab the mycelium block, just like this, all right, uh, oh, I can't remember how to spell it, uh, yeah, there we go. Mycelium, it's got M-Y. So M-Y-C-E-L-I-U-M, guys. You want to get this block here. Mycelium, mycelium, I'm not really sure how it's pronounced. But you want to grab this block because that's the block that the Mosasaurus feeds off. So you want to place one in this corner. And you want to go ahead and fill this entire base with this block. But to make it easy, guys, once again, we need to use commands. So jump down. You want to dig one block down and copy down your coordinates. So in this case, guys, it is 8506. Three, one, one, one. Remember, guys, it will be different depending on your world. Now, we're going to go ahead and you want to jump to the opposite corner, dig one block down, and copy down your coordinates just again. So, once again, we got eight, two, zero, six, three, and eight, two, just like that. Then, guys, you want to work the command block, beautiful magic, and you want to go fill eight, five, zero, space, six, three, space, one, one, one. 
space, and then you want to put in your second set of coordinates, which is 820 space 63 space 82. Then you want to go ahead, and it was my, yep, that's how we spell it, my slim. Hit enter, guys, and voila, we have filled the entire bottom section with this block. And it looks pretty cool. At this point, guys, things are looking pretty great. We got the entire base filled out with the block that for the Mosasaurus to eat. We got the glass to look in. We've added the obsidian for reinforcements. Now we just got to fill the entire thing with water. Now, if you guys are in survival, what you're going to need to do is fill in this entire area just like this with any type of block. And you want to go ahead and place water on these blocks. And then you'll have to go ahead and destroy the block underneath. And as you can see, that'll fill that particular area with water. But because that is going to take absolutely forever considering how massive this thing is. And we're in creative and we have commands. We aren't going to do that, guys. What you want to do is go ahead, come into this top corner here. You can put a little block here for reference for you to stand on just so you know where you're supposed to go. Go ahead and stand in this corner, guys. And you want to go ahead and copy down your coordinates once again. So here we go, guys. It is 8207482, just like that, guys. Then you want to go ahead and jump over to this side where we go ahead and in the exact same corner, guys. You want to copy down your coordinates once again. Then you want to go ahead and do slash fill. You want to go 85074 space 111. So that's this corner. Put in your second lot of coordinates. So 820782. Just like that, guys. And once you've done that, go ahead, space. And you want to go ahead and hit water. Hit enter. And blam, guys. Check it out. We filled our entire Mosasaurus farm with water. So we can actually breathe and live. Because if you put a Mosasaurus on land, Unfortunately, it does. But as you can see, guys, we have filled the entire thing with water. And this cage is absolutely massive. Oh, and one thing I forgot to mention earlier. Mosasauruses live best in jungle biomes. And that's why I've actually built this inside a jungle biome. So I recommend if you guys are building the Mosasaurus farm to build it near a jungle biome or inside one. That would be the recommended place to build it. You can build it anywhere, but jungle biomes generally are the best living conditions for our Mosasaurus. So once you guys have filled that with water, what we want to do is just for a little bit of extra protection in case the Mosasaurus jumps out of the water, is to go ahead and chuck iron bars all on the outer rim of our Mosasaurus farm. So let's go ahead and do that. This is going to take just a little bit of time. So here we go. There we go. We've gone ahead and filled the entire outside rim with iron bars. And this is our Mosasaurus farm done, which is crazy, guys. This thing is ginormous now once you guys have done that you want to come inside the water now it's going to be pretty dark so what i'm going to recommend doing is getting a night vision potion and a water vision potion which will basically allow you to see underwater so let's go ahead and grab those all right cool we go we'll drink the water breathing potion then you want to go ahead and drink the potion of night vision all right sweet now we can see what we're doing underneath here what you want to do guys is right in the center of our uh, Mosasaurus farm is you want to dig one block down. Now, it doesn't have to be exactly in the center, but it has to be near. Then you want to go ahead and dig one more block down just like this. And as you can see, it seems we have hit a cave system. So what we're going to do is you can grab pretty much any block and you want to go ahead and bang, 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 just like that, guys. And what you want to do is grab some, uh, you want to grab a, a lever is probably the best thing to go with. Grab some redstone, and you want to grab a dispenser. And dispenser, just like that, guys. All right, sweet. Now you guys have gotten the main things you need. What we're going to do is, hmm, I'm just trying to figure out exactly how we should pull this off just so this works properly. Now we're going to go ahead. I'm going to place the dispenser right there. And basically right here, guys, you want to put redstone. We're going to need to, first off, all right, this is going to be a little tricky because we've got water in here, but we're going to dig out this entire area just like this. All right, and we want to dig this outside of the Mosasaurus farm so you can get out just like that. Then you want to go ahead and we want to fill this entire top area back up, oh, not with cobblestone, with mycelium or mycelium, guys. And you want to fill the bottom section in here and you want to fill this. Hopefully we can get this to work with redstone. So we're going to have to fill this side in first because redstone is destroyed by water. Now, once you guys have done that, as you can see, we've got this big open space. And what you guys want to do is drag right in here. Oh my gosh, there's water under here as well. All right, so what you want to do is get your redstone, place it into our dispenser just like that. We are going to need a repeater. So let's grab one of those. All right, and repeater, bang. And you want to go ahead and redstone, redstone, redstone down. You want to place a repeater. Then redstone, 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 redstone. 
And then you want to go ahead and dig it out of our Mosasaurus farm. So here we go. Bang, bang, bang. And we'll probably put one more repeater just here. All right. And out just like that, guys. And then you want to go ahead and put a lever right here. This is going to go ahead and activate our dispenser. Once you guys have done that, we can jump back down here and you want to come to our dispenser. Then you want to jump over to our creative inventory. Now, if you are in survival, you're going to need to find a Mosasaurus in an ocean biome. But if you're in creative, you can go ahead and search Mosasaurus. And as you can see here, guys, we've got a Mosasaurus spawn egg. Now, if you guys don't have that, that's because you need to download an add-on. I will have the download link in the description below, so you guys can go ahead and download this as well. Once you guys have downloaded that, grab your Mosasaurus spawn egg, and you want to go ahead and chuck those inside our dispenser. Then you want to go ahead, once you've done that, guys, and prepare, guys. We are about to spawn our Mosasaurus in our Mosasaurus farm, guys. You ready? Here we go, guys. Three... Two, one, bang guys, hit the lever, and hopefully we should have, wow, all right, that was really anticlimactic, it didn't, sp oh, oh, we got a Mosasaurus, guys, we got a baby one, what, we actually got a baby Mosasaurus in our Mosasaurus farm, what are the chances of actually getting our baby Mosasaurus, let's go ahead and hit the lever again, hopefully we'll get a bigger one this time, there we go, guys, check it out, we have a Mosasaurus in our Mosasaurus farm. Look at how absolutely massive this guy is inside our Mosasaurus farm. That is humongous. Mind blown. I can't believe this farm actually works. And oh my gosh, the Mosasaurus actually ate the baby Mosasaurus. As I was saying earlier, these guys will literally eat anything, even if they're from the same type of dinosaur. Even though they were, you know, part of the same family. The Mosasaurus literally ate the baby one straight away. That is insane. Look at how ginormous this dinosaur is, guys. Even his tail is kind of glitching outside of the farm. That's how absolutely huge he is. I can't believe he isn't breaking through our cage, honestly. Obviously, you can see that this uh, farm actually works. That is absolutely insane that we have a Mosasaurus farm in Minecraft, you guys have to agree, this is pretty awesome. If you guys did enjoy today's video and you want to see more videos just like that, make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and uh, make sure, you know what, if you enjoyed the video, that is pretty cool. Make sure, if you didn't though, leave a like for the Mosasaurus, because look at him, he is absolutely ginormous. That is insane, guys. But that brings us to the end of today's video. I will see you in the next one. Until then, guys, anyway, stream out. Yeah!